In this demonstration, we will highlight the ability to rapidly provision a brand new server from within the Stratascale portal. You'll notice that we're logging into a secure web environment, which can be accessed through any HTML-based browser, including those on mobile devices. After logging into the Stratascale portal, you'll note that the initial screen is the dashboard, showing all computing infrastructure currently within our environment. In our case here, we have physical servers, private cloud virtual servers, and public cloud virtual servers. Regardless of the type, we can manage, configure, and provision any of our servers from the same dashboard, allowing for ease of system administration. I'll select one of my new unprovisioned physical servers. Now, on the server details screen, I will give the server a name for easy identification. Next, we'll allocate storage and define an operating system to this server. We include all Microsoft server operating systems, various Linux distributions, and the capability to utilize virtualization technology from both Microsoft and VMware. I'll give the volume a name and description. Specify a starting volume size. The reserve disk percentage is used for two features included by default within our hosting solution. Boot level snapshots and volume cloning. I'll enter a value of 5. This will reserve 5% of my overall volume to take boot level snapshots and to take volume clones. Now that the volume has been created, I'll configure the network. I'll select the network to use, add an internal IP address, And if this server is going to be on the internet, I'll add a public IP address. After the IP addresses have been applied, the Stratascale interface is intuitive enough to know that now we need to control access to the server. With that, firewall rules shows in the portal as a dropdown to begin configuring. Clicking on Add Firewall Rule brings up a dialog box to Allow and Deny. All standard based IP protocols. Source and destination can be servers internally and externally to the Stratascale managed hosting environment. And we allow configuration of all port options that are standard and also non standard options as well. application port monitoring and server failover. Port monitoring is included by default with each Stratascale environment. After turning port monitoring on, I can select the monitored IP address. and select from the drop-down list of the ports that I would like to have monitored. You 
after all of my configuration options have been input and put in place I can turn the server on and start a server console screen showing the server as it boots at BIOS level.